I make them talk to the crowd after the game. <laughs> Puck is dropped. We are underway here on Senior Night with Public Service of New Hampshire powering UNH Ice Hockey, PSNH. The power is in our people. Wildcats able to dump it down into the zone. Cross in front. Muse able to turn it aside. Back at the point. Hardaway down to the right corner for McCarry. To Pavelski in the right circle. To take a shot. Muse will make a save and hold on for a faceoff. With 13-16 to go here in the first period. No score, but the fourth line. Getting some action, generating a chance. Yeah, you got to like that. Into the zone now for Moses. Moses tries a shot, blocked by Mullane. Comes up the right boards for Kessel. Kessel down to the right corner. Clears one in in front of the net. It deflected off the top of the net as it went through some traffic. Here's Kessel. Kessel into the high slot. Kessel with a shot. Save is made by Muse. This time he'll hold on for a faceoff. 8.28 to go first period. No score. Faceoff coming up. Circles it back to his blue line. Now creates speed through center ice. Spielman gets a shot away. It's blocked. Spielman gets it back. Sends this one towards the front. And it's in. It gets deflected on its way to the front. And it rolls across the line. And the Wildcats take a 1-0 lead with 155 to go in the first. Feeds it back down to the right corner for Sislow. He'll wrap it around the boards for Thompson. He's got it in the left corner. Behind the net here, Sislo carries his way over to the left boards, plays it up to the left point for Kessel. Left board pass Sislo, back up to the right point, Kostelanski. Midpoint here is Kessel with it. Kessel to Sislo. One-timer, score! One-timer! Sislo, top of the left circle. A power play goal and a 2-0 lead for the Wildcats. 9.09 to go in the second period. Wildcats have a 2-0 lead. Dumoulin to center ice, ahead to Atkinson. Atkinson in across the line, left boards, pulls up there, feeds it to Dumoulin in the high slot. Dumoulin spins away from a man, feeds it down here for Gibbons. He takes a shot, save is made, rebounds in front, and there's a score for BC on the power play. It's Almeida, and it's a 2-1 game with 8.55 to go in the second. Into the zone goes Joe Whitney. Joe Whitney goes back behind the net. He leaves it on those far boards. Henry is going to get it there for the Wildcats. It's a 2-1 game here now. Here's a long up ice feed for Spielman. He's back behind the defense. Spielman walking in. Spielman gets a shot away. It's loose there and knocked back behind the net. Initial save made by Muse. Now a bid by Henry and goes wide off a centering feed from Spielman. The net and play it around to the near side for Campanelli. Campanelli able to push the puck up the wall here for Henry. And Henry in a head man feeds. Spielman in his skates able to backhand it across the line. Picked up there, though, by Dumoulin. His up ice feed behind the defense is Atkinson. Breakaway, shot, score. Cam Atkinson sneaks between the defenders, walks in on the breakaway, and ties the game 2-2 two to two with 12.4 seconds to go in the period. Center ice, Kessel on it there. He'll send it back into the zone. Albert knocked it down and played it over for Dumoulin. Dumoulin's up by speed for Atkinson. Into the zone he goes. Atkinson working his way, dropping it off in the left circle for Gibbons. Gets around the defense, gets a shot away. Save is made by Deidre Alamo, and the rebound cleared. To center ice, now Sissel plays it for Thompson. Thompson in across the line. Thompson to Simone. It's knocked away, and out into center ice. Here comes Mullane, and a two-on-two -two with Carey. Carey gives it back to Mullane. He has to go down to the right corner to get after it. Kostelanski tying him up there. Carey comes away with it. Into the high slot for Cross. A shot and a score. Tommy Cross gives the Eagles their first lead of the game. It's 3-2 with 16.08 to go in the third. He's regular season title on the line. They want the W. Two goals they need. They need to start generating some excitement here. Get the crowd back into it with some of these deep face-off. They're going to get a good win here. In the slot, Sislo trying to gather it. Sissel plays it back to the point for Campanelli. Left side. He'll send it in around the wall. Behind the net is DeSimone. Plays it to Thompson. A shot blocked in front. Thompson to Sislo. His shot. That's also blocked. Puck's sitting loose. Who's going to find it? DeSimone does. Score! Phil DeSimone finds the loose puck in front of the net. Ties the game 3-3 three to three with 10 away to go. Boston College tied up here 3-3. Five minutes even remaining in the third period. Dan Parker, and P. Webster. Good to have you with us. The final game of the regular season with the Hockey East regular season title on the line. Here's Cross working around the players to get a shot away. The save is made, but Mullane's all alone on the doorstep to score on the rebound, and the Eagles retake a lead. It's 4-3. to three. This way, we'll set up and do it all over again here. Another critical faceoff. Bill DeSimone looking to win. DeSimone against Atkinson again. Wildcats get possession of this one. Thompson plays the puck back behind the net. It gets over into the near corner. Spielman sends a puck to the point, Kostelanski over to Kessel here at the midpoint. Into the left circle for Sislo, eight seconds to go. Sislo takes a shot, blocked wide. Thompson tries to bank it in, cannot. Comes here to Sislo, he gets a shot away that's blocked. Sislo gets it back, another shot blocked. Now trying to stuff it in is Thompson, cannot do it. And the Boston College Eagles will win the Hockey East regular season title after a fourth.